Hello and welcome to the session. Let us discuss the following question. It says find x plus 1 whole to the power 6 plus x minus 1 whole to the power 6. Hence or otherwise evaluate root 2 plus 1 whole to the power 6 plus root 2 minus 1 whole to the power 6. Now to solve this question we need to know the expansion of a plus b whole to the power n which is given by nc0 a to the power n plus nc1 a to the power n minus 1 b plus nc2 a to the power n minus 2 b to the power 2 so on and the last term is nc n b to the power n and the expansion of a minus b whole to the power n is nc0 a to the power n minus nc1 a to the power n minus 1 b plus nc2 a to the power n minus 2 b to the power 2 so on the last term will be minus 1 to the power n nc n b to the power n so this knowledge will work as key idea let us now proceed on with the solution we have to obtain x plus 1 whole to the power 6 plus x minus 1 whole to the power 6. Now we find the expansion of x plus 1 whole to the power 6 using this expansion. Here n is 6. So this is equal to 6 c0 x to the power 6 plus 6 c1 x to the power 6 minus 1 that is 5 into 1 here b is 1 6 c2 x to the power 4 into 1 to the power 2 plus 6 c3 x to the power 3 into 1 to the power 3 plus 6 c4 x to the power 2 into 1 to the power 4 plus 6 c5 into x into 1 to the power 5 plus 6 c6 into 1 to the power 6. Now we find x minus 1 whole to the power 6 using this expansion. Here n is 6, a is x and b is 1. So this is equal to 6 c0 x to the power 6 minus 6 c1 x to the power 5 into 1 plus 6 c2 x to the power 4 into 1 to the power 2 minus 6 c3 x to the power 3 into 1 to the power 3 plus 6 c4 x to the power 2 into 1 to the power 4 minus 6 c5 into x into 1 to the power 5 plus minus 1 to the power 6 6 c6 into 1 to the power 6. Now we add these two expressions. Now when we add these two expressions we see that 6 c1 x to the power 5 gets cancelled with minus 6 c1 x to the power 5 6 c3 x to the power 3 gets cancelled with minus 6 c3 x to the power 3 and 6 c5 x gets cancelled with minus 6 c5 x now this expression is equal to twice of 6 c0 x to the power 6 plus twice of 6 c2 x to the power 4 plus twice of 6 c4 x to the power 2 plus twice of 6 c6 Now again this is equal to 
taking two common, we have 2 into 6 v 0 x to the power 6 is equal to x to the power 6 because 6 v 0 is 1. 6 c 2 is 15. So the second term is 15 into x to the power 4. 6 c 4 is 15. So the third term is 15 into x to the power 2 plus 6 c 6 is 1. So the last term is 1. Hence x plus 1 whole to the power 6 plus x minus 1 whole to the power 6 is equal to 2 into x to the power 6 plus 15 x to the power 4 plus 15 x to the power 2 plus 1. Now we have to find the value of root 2 plus 1 whole to the power 6 plus root 2 minus 1 whole to the power 6. Now here x is root 2. So, we just substitute the value of x here. Therefore, root 2 plus 1 whole to the power 6 plus root 2 minus 1 whole to the power 6 is equal to 2 into root 2 the power 6 plus 15 into root 2 to the power 4 plus 15 into root 2 the power 2 plus 1. Again this is equal to 2 into root 2 to the power 6 is 8 and 15 into 4 is 60, 15 into 2 is 30 plus 1 and this is equal to 198. Hence the answer is 2 into x to the power 6 plus 15 x to the power 4 plus 15 x to the power 2 plus 1 and to the second part answer is 198. So this completes the question. Hope you enjoy the session. Goodbye and take care.